The overall goal of this procedure is to use high-resolution respirometry to determine mitochondrial oxygen consumption. This method can help answer key questions in the syndromes and diseases associated with mitochondrial dysfunction, such as sepsis, diverse neurological diseases, and age-related disorders. The main advantages of this technique is that it has higher sensitivity and the ability to perform substrate uncoupler inhibitor titrations experiments with a small number of biological samples such as intact or permeabilized cells. Demonstrating the procedure will be Sandra Nansos, a technician from my laboratory. Before beginning the procedure, air calibrate the polarographic oxygen sensors. Then resuspend the cells in respiration buffer to a 1 times 10 to the 6 cells per milliliter concentration and replace the respiration medium in one chamber of the oxygraph with 2.1 milliliters of the cell suspension. Close the chamber with the stopper and set the magnetic stirring bar in the chamber to 700 rotations per minute. Then record the cellular respiration for 5 to 10 minutes until a stable oxygen flux signal is achieved. Next, use a syringe to inject 2 microliters of rotenone through the titanium injection port into the oxygraph chamber and record the cellular respiration for another 5 to 10 minutes. When a stable oxygen flux signal is achieved, inject 20 microliters of 1 molar succinate followed by 10 microliters of 0.5 molar ADP. Then inject two volumes of two microliters of two millimolar digitonin and record the cellular respiration for two to five minutes after each injection, followed by